Welcome back to Green Wave Hockey right here on FCAT Sports. Skate Dr. Lou Bordeaux with you. Green Wave State Champions. That is never going to get old. Uh, we're going to recap the scoring and then I've got a special surprise here. Uh, in the first period, Green Wave got on the board first. Derek Lenoise in the slot. Spun around, collected his own rebound, banged it home. We're going to give Kyle Barnes and Kevin Bowman assists on that one. Made it one nothing Green Wave. A uh, strange turn of events. Uh, there was a little bit of a disagreement. Green Wave ended up with a delay of game penalty right off the bat. So shortly thereafter, Hunter Arsenault of uh, Lunenburg managed to get a power play goal, tying the game at one. And that was how the first period ended. The score was one to one. Lunenburg scored early in the second period to take a two to one lead. Sorry, I didn't get the name of the skater there. With a minute 31 left in the second period, Shane Prusak, and we talked about it on Bear Country, uh, that green line, Shane, Kyle Barnes, Derek Lenoise, for the second half of the season, just hard workers, no, no let up on that one. Jacob Bryant set up Shane Prusak, who buried that one, made it two to two. And that's where the game stood. Two periods in the books, two to two. Third period, great back and forth action, up and down the ice. It looked for sure like we were destined for another overtime situation like we saw in the Wakona game a few days ago. But at 13.29 of the third period, Brian Bowman caught a shot, may have caused some damage to his digit there, we hope not. Caught the puck, dropped it down, skated in about 40 feet away, let a one-timer go. Beat the Lunenburg Tendi, high, high blocker, and well, that was it. Three to two, Green Wave. And uh, to say that uh, the whole team is exhilarated would be an understatement. We're outdoors right now. The team has just gotten on the bus. And at this time, I'm going to call in my special guest. Didn't get a chance to talk to him before the game, head coach Adam Bouchard. Hey, coach? Ah, never better. I'll tell you what, congratulations on this one. You've got the hardware. Uh, what's going through your mind? Unbelievable. You know, <clears throat> nobody deserves it, more, deserves it more than those student athletes on that bus. We walked in that Monday after Thanksgiving with a mission. We told them from day one they were going to work harder than anybody else. And as the season progressed and the season went on, we continued to do so. And when you believe in something and you work hard enough for it, I think we just showed those young men and women that play for the entire Greenway program that if you face adversity in life and you work hard through it, you do it the Green Wave way, good things will happen. You know, and really, really, really proud of how they performed. Couldn't agree with you more. It was 97 days ago that 40 some odd student athletes hit the ice for the first time, and this was their ultimate goal. Of course, the ones who are the varsity players got to enjoy this, but a heck of a turnout by the JV players helped out with us. Uh, I saw a lot of them around the, uh, around the rink surface tonight. So hats off to all of them. I think the program was well represented um, just this this is as good as it gets in uh, in our uh, in our industry you know to all the student athletes in this program to all the history in this program I believe it's about 78 years we've got a state title now we can raise I know back in 08 Western Mass Finals was the furthest the team could go yep they added another level we we're able to bring it home and I gotta say the support that this community has given this hockey program from day one this year, I really appreciate everybody's energy and time that they've given to these student athletes all year long, whether it was at home at the CMA, whether it was on the road, whether it was up in Pittsfield, 
or down the other end of the state here in Worcester. This community really, really showed its support for these boys and girls. And look at, we did it. We did it. Adam Bouchard, I'm gonna close out with one thing here. Your first year as head coach of the team, we talked after the season, you said, Doc, I've got a five-year plan. Here's the results. Congratulations, five, my friend. Five years later, we did it, didn't we? Go Green. That's it for this season of Green Wave Hockey on FCAT Sports. I am the Skate Doctor. For Adam Bouchard, the whole staff, we're excited. Thank you for joining us, and we'll see you again in December. Good night from Worcester.